What is the goddamn deal, people? It's Bright Side again. Ah, we back at it. Feeling much better, too. Goddamn. My voice a little bit deeper, but shit. Sound like Barry White in this motherfucker. Yeah. And all stay stands. Are you in good hands, bitch? Are you in good hands? Look at that. I ain't get used to this. <laughs> nah, but seriously, uh, I ended up getting sick uh, this past holidays. I hope everybody had a wonderful Christmas and a hell of a New Year's, man. I know uh, 2017 wasn't the best of years for general, generally speaking. 2017 was all right. It was pretty good. Had some really good games. Me, myself, personally, I, I mean, shit, I'm the best, so, nah. <laughs> nah, it was, uh, it was pretty cool for me, man, in case y'all wonder. Uh, I started my YouTube in 2017, towards the end, you know, I'm trying to be more consistent doing my shit. Last week, I just told y'all, man, I've been sick like a motherfucker, man, like, super sick. Uh... Like, I probably post a clip of how I sounded like before and uh, just edit this shit out. But man, I sounded like some shit, dog. It was, it was bad. <sighs> some thorough flu. Um, trying to get better. Uh, I'm still Twitch streaming. <laughs> but, y'all know why I'm here today, man. Y'all know what I'm here. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all already know what it is. What happened today, man? What happened today? What happened? Y'all already know what the fuck happened. It was some more news about Bayonetta. All right? Now, no, actually, you know what? It was some more news uh, in regards to uh, Devil May Cry. So, you know what I'm saying? Just a tweet. Just a little tweet. You know? Just a little comment, but you know what I'm saying, for the steady fan, for a fan that's been, I mean, in the trenches since jump, you can see the hieroglyphics and the little shit, man. There's uh, double meanings and codes to shit that is said on Twitter by these directors. And you know what this director said? Uh, let me pull up, let me pull up that tweet for you, see what he said. I'ma see if y'all could figure out something that was a little bit, a little bit, a little bit catchy. You might miss it, but the steady fan, the fan that's been there since jump, you'll see, you'll be like, oh, I caught that, huh? That may be something there, huh? Somebody else be like, oh, oh, that's, that's good news. But you, you know, you know, boy. So anyway, Let's see what my man said. Y'all ready for this? Looking at. Anyway, Mr. Itsuno. This is his tweet. This is what he said. Pay attention. Happy New Year. I'm sorry that I cannot present a new project last year. This English is fucked. You know, it's bad literature. You know what I'm saying? The development of the project is now under climax. I am making a great game, so please expect it. Mm. That's what he said, people. He said, and I quote, he said, the development of the project is now under climax. Interesting choice of words. Climax. Almost as if, I don't know, there was a uh, certain reference to a certain other character. But we won't read into it too much. It's not feasible, Mr. Peroxide. These two franchises, Devil May Cry and Bayonetta, are created by the exact same man. Created both of the franchises has publicly stated he would like uh, a Bayonetta and Devil May Cry crossover or slash guest appearance. He's even gone and denied the possibility of there being a crossover in the Project X game. He denied Capcom. He told him, no, bitch. I want them to fucking interact on my accord. 
when I say I want my story on how they end up interacting. You telling me you don't think that that tweet is insinuate? We already know Devil May Cry 5 is in the works. How the fuck is the game in its climax? What do you mean by that? Like what, like what the fuck are we talking about, B? Nah. But seriously, I'm like at a 70%. I'm at like a 70% there's gonna be some kind of reference in DMC5 to Bayonetta. I'm like, that's enough. Like even a reference, even a little hint, like the bitch could just pop up on the television in the background and be like, hey, that's it, you know? Could be some shit like that. But that would be really interesting if that was to happen, yo. That would be crazy. Because Bayonetta 3 is in development and Devil May Cry 5 is in development. Could you imagine if they had like, like the games were tied in some kind of way, like canon, like there was something going on. Okay, I'm going a little bit off, all right? Don't pay no mind to me, but that shit would be nuts. And now that I think about it, that whole idea, that whole talk about uh, another character in that leak list, possible new to the universe, could be Bayonetta. That, why Climax? Who says that? Like, who says that? Like, come on, yo, like, think. Who says that? Who says the game is at its climax? Like, what? And when you talk about development, I mean, huh? Bro, that is a reference. Why use that word? Why use it? We ain't playing it. Like, what the fuck do you mean? Like, are you talking about like the ending? Like y'all at the end of the game? <laughs> I don't know. That's, that's a weird kind of thing to say when you're talking about uh, the finishing touches on your new project is all. That's all I'm saying. But let's stop. All right, let's stop. There's not, at most, all right, at the very most, I would like to just see her and if she's if she's integrated into the actual fucking plot, now that would be crazy. Now this is all theoretical, like we reaching here, we just speculating. That's basically it, dog. I think that that is a reference to there may be a hint of some Bayo and some uh, and that Devil May Cry Five. That'd be cool. We know it's not no Dragon's Dogma. We know it's not no other shit. I know it's Devil May Cry Five. I know it, I fucking know it. DMC5 is in the works, it's happening. Like, fuck all the speculate, the shit is happening, all right? I'm pretty sure a lot of other people that are longtime fans are like thinking the same thing. I just thought I'd just make a video of it, you know, talking about it to see what you guys thought. See if anybody else thought the same shit. Because to me, that's the first thing popped off in my head. Am I tripping, you know? Or is there some validity to that? That make you think, that I share some details with you that made you think about some of the stuff that's been said in the past. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys, again, had a wonderful, you know, Christmas. Got some good shit. Tell me what you got for Christmas, you know what I'm saying? I ain't really get much. As a matter of fact, I don't think anybody got me anything except for my wife. That's it, man. She the only person that got me something. Nobody else care. Or don't nobody else got money. But it's all good, you know. It's being around family and shit like that. And plus, most of the time I get everything that I want myself. I work for the shit that I want to get. But, I uh, hope you had a wonderful Christmas and stuff like that. A wonderful New Year's. Hope you had all the fun that you could have ever had in 2017. And hope more. 2018 you know what I'm saying and more of a me too I plan on trying to dish out more content to you guys than weekly stuff but I try to make sure that I do stream almost every single fucking day so if you guys want to talk to me follow me on twitch you know if you hit up my twitch guaranteed you will get a notification at least four times out of the week that I'm streaming and most of the time I'm streaming in charting so just follow me on Twitch, put the link in the description. You can hit me up on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Twitch. So 
That's it. That's all my social media. I got an Instagram, but it's more for like personal shit. It's more for people that are like close to me. But you can hit me up on there too. Most of the shit that you see on there is gonna be like family stuff, so I don't know. I got a little anime shit every now and again, cool stuff, but it's mostly just personal stuff with me. I ain't, you know, that's just all that is. But, like again, comment, share, like, subscribe, hit that bell icon so you can get notified when I do upload vids or whichever, man. Hope you guys have a bang up. 2018 go in strong you know what i'm saying and uh we're gonna finish on top peace out got that chick-fil-a mm. all right damn chick-fil-a sauce i feel like an old fucking sex ass burger king commercial or some shit try out the new spicy chicken deluxe sandwich motherfucker that shit gonna be litty. Only two ninety nine. Try a new Chick Fil A sauce. Only twenty five cents at your local chicken for. <coughs> <coughs> oh yeah.